Hi, welcome to Raw Visions Demo Forum. Today I will be showing you how you can incubate your egg from the start to finish. I'm going to be taking this one step at a time for a better understanding. Alright, now the first thing you need to do is to prepare whatever you'll be using for your incubation before you start sorting your eggs. Here we are using the disposable plates for incubation at Raw Vision Farm. This is what we use for our incubation. Now this is our soil. Now the first thing is, if the sand is too dry, if it's too dry, you are supposed to add a little water to make it moist. You don't use dry sand to incubate your egg and you don't use moldy uh, sand to also incubate your eggs. The water shouldn't be too much, neither too little. Alright, so now that you have gotten the taste of the sand that we want, now that we've gotten the taste of the sand that we want, we'll first of all bring it into our disposable plate as the base. Now most times some starters or some farmers will pick the eggs from their farm, put them in a plate before going through all this process. And from our experience, it's not very okay. If you need 100% touchability, 90% touchability, then you shouldn't be going through that process of taking the eggs from the pen, putting them in a plate or putting them in water before you incubate them. You take them straight from the pen to where you want to incubate them. And if you're using the, the, the pen for incubation, you already dig the hole that you want to incubate it, then you take it from the pen straight into where you are putting them. And so, since we are using the disposable plate, we'll first of all put our loamy soil as the base, and then we're going into our farm to fetch the eggs. All right, for this video sake, we won't be go doing uh, multiple sorting of the eggs We'll be scattering the whole farm for this video's sake. Now, we've gotten this. The next part here is to cover it up. You cover it up completely. You cover the eggs all up completely. Now take note that you are not molding the sand. You are scattering the sand as you are dropping it on the eggs. Now when this is done, if you notice that the sand that you are adding to it is still dry, just sprinkle water. Don't pour water on it. Just sprinkle water. A little sprinkling. Now when this is done, your eggs are incubated and you wait for 21 days max for them to start coming out on their own accord. You don't go back and start digging the eggs to check if they have hashed. If they've hashed, they will all come out from the soil. And then you are not also supposed to be wetting it every day. If you check, when you come to your farm and you check that the sand is dried, you can just sprinkle a little water, don't pour water on it, and then you let it stay again. But take note that when you're keeping your disposable plate, don't put it where there will be sun ray or too much wind. Put it in a cool place so that the eggs can retain this first coldness, this first temperature in which you started the incubation with and your ashability is sure. If you find this information very interesting and impressed, give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.